It's been revealed the person responsible for one of the world's greatest wildlife massacres is a Sydney man. In an extraordinary interview with Seven News, the fur trader laughed at claims it's cruel to kill baby seals, a slaughter condemned by conservationists like Sir Paul McCartney. These are Namibian fur seals. The men with the clubs have come to kill them. And those men are employed by this man, Sydney tycoon Hatem Yavutz. You are the king of, se of seal culling. <laughs> What's going to be a crown on my head? <laughs> a crown on my head. He controls 60% of the global seal fur market, making millions. To have an Australian businessman involved in such cruel slaughter is unimaginable. The wives of my friends go, oh, you're a disgrace. <laughs> You're a disgrace. I, I get that quite often. <laughs> it doesn't worry you very much. Well, what for? I believe in what I do. And here's why. We're looking at about <laughs> 30,000 Aussie dollars. Oh, wow. It's expensive, huh? Um, yeah, you buy a car. Seven News tracked Yavutz from his home on Sydney's northern beaches to his factory in Istanbul. This is where skins from Namibia, Canada and Greenland are processed for some of the biggest brands in fashion. Behind me are the skins of 14,000 seals, but that's just the tip of the iceberg. This operation will process 130,000 seals in a single year. A business so lucrative, he tried breeding seals in cages. It didn't work because they need to swim. Seal fur is restricted in Europe, the US and Australia, but not Turkey or Russia. It's an issue that has sparked international protests. You're the seal killer. Yeah, but uh, and and in their country, they're like the fox killer, the mink killers, the, the ra raccoon killers, the beaver killers, and I can just go on with all the killers. Conservationists say harvesting any fur is wrong. We are out here to see if we can lend our voice to this uh, campaign and maybe get it stopped once and for all. How do you feel about the seals? Don't ask me, ask the seals. <laughs> Don't ask me, ask the seals. How do I feel? I mean, it's just, it's a job. If I don't do it, someone else is going to do it. Mike Duffy, 7 News.